Okay, Android 13 Developer Preview 1 is already released, of course. And if you want to take a look at this on a Redmi Note 9S or Pro or Pro Max, Poco M2 Pro, any one of these devices, you can install this thing. Available and installed from Custom Gurry is you can simply do this if you want to, if you are interested, if you are willing to install Android 13 right now. This is called Android Tiramisu with the latest February 2022 security patch and it's just a developer preview one. So yes, there are no major changes. Of course, you can see the Easter egg is also still Android 12. It was expected, of course, it was same with the Android 11, Android 12 cases. So yes, it's almost same in Android 13 case too. As this is a ported room for this mutual device user, so you might expect some bugs. I'm not sure because I didn't got any major bugs so far, but there might be some minor bugs here and there. In this latest Android 13 quick settings panel, you just saw the one handed mode tile is added here, including that the color correction tile is also added. So, these are some interesting things which you get in Android 13 developer preview. One, some things if you want to take a look at in the Android 13 developer preview, the things which are added or the changes, etc. A specific video link is available, so make sure to check out that. You have the Pixel Launcher pre installed as it's a ported room, and of course, it was expected that you will get the Pixel Launcher pre installed. Let's just straight away talk about the camera section and that what is the camera which you get pre-installed. The camera which you get pre-installed is the Google Camera Go Edition which is as expectedly far more better than the normal snap camera. It is working fine, no issues in this camera. Of course, there might be some minor bugs. For example, if I try switching here, it was just force closing but it's not a big deal. Of course, you can use the normal mode, Gcam mode if you want to and the working Gcam mode. Yes, I have available on my tech current cloud channel, so make sure to check out from there. This is called a safety net attestation checker. And yes, it was also expected that safety net status will not pass here. It is not passing. Of course, without root, it will not pass at all. You can root your device, install some magisk modules, and you can pass the safety net status. And me, I al already have the video on those things that how you can pass the safety net status and run banking apps in Android 12. A lot of videos available on that so make sure to check out those things if you are having any issues while passing safety status in any one of your devices or custom rooms etc other things of features etc are kind of same this is the android 30 mutual build so you might not face you might not get any kind of features etc it's a normal ported room not a modified custom room of course wallpapers and style you can customize these colors etc which is just working perfectly fine so yes this is also something good else things are kind of same you have the face lock you sorry don't have the face unlock of course face lock app lock nothing is available it was expected um gestures etc all the things are available here how to install this thing install from custom recovery the link for that build is in the description make sure you're using the orange fox custom recovery or twrp and you're good to go this is all thanks for watching goodbye Like I'm floating through the air